was in my room. All alone. Uh, in my house. <coughs> in my house in Lagos. I was just there, all alone. I was heartbroken. I was shattered. That was, uh, that was a few days, a few days after I lost my son, my first son. Uh, I was knocked out, just in my room, down. I couldn't understand why it happened. And I just couldn't understand. I was all alone. I was all alone in my room, shattered. And then, God spoke to me. I heard that voice. The voice came in. God said a couple of things to me. Um, first one, he said, My son, don't think I don't love Good day, ladies and gentlemen. It's another beautiful day to talk about challenges in Nigeria. Today on this episode, we are going to be looking at you, Lady Uh This guy, uh, hmm, <laughs> this guy. In recent days, we have heard of his engagements in church, introducing his true salvation ministries. I'm sure most persons are acquainted with this particular name, Yule Doche. Yule is a renowned Nollywood actor who sometime last year swam into real estate and now he's introduced the true salvation ministry. I'm sure at this point, I don't even know because this guy has been trending for quite some time and for various reasons. You remember the marriage saga he had between his wife, May Duche and Judy Austin? With the year starting with the popular slogan in our Niger, you know, no grief for anybody. <laughs> I'm sure this guy means every word of it. I have a calling to... I have a calling to serve God. I have a calling to be a minister of God. I, I have a calling to be a preacher of God, you know. Um, to be one of God's It's the ministerial call for me in actual sense. The ministerial call. Ah, now wow. Is it some form of confusion? Because I'm trying to understand this. Could it be true God's calling? Like the word true, like in the actual sense of it, in the true salvation ministry? Or is it probably because of uh, money, like another business avenue to cash out? I've been at just for film. What? I don't understand. You know? And in all this, is it that the movie industry isn't paying him enough? Or what he, he was getting from his uh, 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 the, the real estate thing wasn't satisfying? Talking about the real estate thing, I actually felt this guy was inspired by polygamy to build more homes for more wives. <laughs> Seriously, because the way they look at self, eh? Chai, um, this one suits me. <laughs> Oh, coming King Solo, almighty part of the great Superbuy Empire. I greet you, salute for you, bye bye. Uh -huh. uh, regardless, anyway, there's nothing God cannot do. And uh, after all, I mean, what God cannot do doesn't exist. But oh um, uh, but I know say God no fit stop to be God, shall night be. I mean, night be see get what in him no fit to be that. Abi, chai, oh um, uh, too much sense to the king. But as we did so, I shall hope the item of his church will not be uh, 12, 12, 12. No missing a month, like it's not yellow. I know deal before they talk to me. I just they talk my own on one side. Because this particular call, eh, ah, <laughs> it's a hot one. I shall hope it's not a missed call. He saw from God and was thinking it was an actual call. As it started hot, hot, oh, because hmm, I pray it ends hot, hot. Who am I to judge anyway? My country people, I just want you to think about these inconsistencies. Take your time. What's your take? You know, what's your take in all this? What does he really want? Is he confused? Or, you know, sometimes God will allow you to do a lot of things before he, uh, you know, comes to you. So could it be through God's calling? Just, you know, think about it and what's your take? Could it be divine or not? Until next time, my dears, have a beautiful day. Thank you. That's the whole essence of uh, me being 
um, very popular, very celebrated as an actor, very big, you know, with lots and lots of lots of fans, you know, millions and millions of fans all over the world, in Nigeria and Africa and beyond. Um, I feel that's it. I, I think I've, I think I've found my purpose in life.